Hi there, it's Sherry Smotherman Short from Painless Blog Analytics, and today I want to show you how to set up a new Google Analytics property that you can use to track your results from your web stories. So the first thing that we're going to do is we're going to click over into Analytics, and then down here in the bottom right you're going to see, I'm sorry, the bottom left you're going to see um, an admin button. We're going to click on that. Make sure you're in the right account. Most of you probably only have one account, uh, but just in case, you do want to make sure that you're in the right account here. Now, what we're going to do is we're going to click Create Property in this middle column. And then um, we need to put the property name in here, and I'm going to do Painless Blog Analytics Web Stories. So we're going to click on Show Advanced Options, and then we're going to click the button to toggle on Create a Universal Analytics Property. Next, we need to put our website URL in here, and since this is going to be for our web stories, we need to put in the URL of the landing page for our web stories, and that's going to be just your regular URL with a slash, and then you're going to do web-stories, make that plural, and then once you've got that in there, we need to click this button that says Create a Universal Analytics Property Only. Then we're going to click Next. It's going to ask you a little bit about your business. Um, you know, you could just put whatever you want to in there. And then we're going to create the, um, the property. Okay, now we are in our Painless Black Analytics Web Story property, and we're on the tracking code screen. So what we need to do here is Copy this. So copy the, the tracking ID, the UA, with all the numbers. And then we are going to go over to our blog, and we're going to look in the Stories section. Now this is assuming that you already have the Google Web Stories plugin installed on your site. We're going to click on Settings, and then right here at the top it says Enter your Google Analytics tracking code. This is where we're going to put our code. Then we're going to, get, going to click Save. And that's all there is to it. You now have your own tracking code for your web stories.